Welcome back to Math Tomorrow. So today we're going to be looking at some uh, important trigonomic, uh, trigonometric identities <coughs> that are going to help you um, solve many problems, right? That, um, you know, just like, in general, if you want to, like, a simplified problem, that's, uh, good, you know, you'll usually look at that, like, from what we've learned so far, like, you usually look at, like, our, our example here, cosine of 75 degrees, and say, oh, we, like, we from what we know, like, our chart that we usually make, we can't really find that, right? But uh, these trigonometric identities, right, the sum and difference identities here written down here, these are really going to help us um, solve problems like this. So um, let me just introduce these to you. So um, these are called sum and, different ident sum and difference identities because obviously you can see here, here you're adding a plus b, here you're um, doing a minus b, that's why there's sum and difference. And here we have them for cosine and sine. And um, tangent we'll get to later. So. Let's just dive into this example for now. All right, so um, cosine of 75 degrees. Well, how can we rewrite 75 degrees uh, using the values that we know so far? Well, uh, if you think about it, yeah, so we can use um, 30 and 45, right? So it'll be cosine of 30 degrees plus 45 degrees, right? Because then 30 plus 45, that's 75, right? So, um, so now we use our, our sum identity, right? Like you can see here, it's a plus b, right? You can write this as cosine of a plus b. So, you'll solve it this way, right? So now just to make it easier, right? Since this is our first time, we're going to use our table, all right? So, 0, 30, 45, 60, 90, sine, cosine. That's all we need so far. So, it's 0, 1 half, root 2, root 3 over 2, 1, 1, root 3 over 2, one over two, one over two, and zero. So here, it's just gonna be cosine of a. Let me write this out for you first. So it's um, cosine a, cosine a, 30. Well, we can also rewrite these also in, no, no, we'll just keep it. We'll just keep it though. Okay, well, 30 degrees, um, cosine 45 degrees, plus, minus sine 30 degrees sine 45 degrees so now we just input our values right um cosine of 30 is root 3 over 2 times cosine of 45 is 1 over 2 minus sine of 30 is 1 half and then sine of 45 is uh 1 over root 2 so this is simplified too well we have the same denominator here right so we can just rewrite this as root 3 because it's root 3 times 1 minus 1 times 1 is 1 so over 2 root 2 and yeah that's really it that's how you can use what we have so far let me write the answer here root 3 minus 1 2 over root 2 so yeah that's how we use our new trig identities to solve problems that we usually would not be able to do without them thank you